Hello, everyone. Sometimes we encounter with some patients who don't want to open up with us, especially in psychiatry wards. Uh, for example, uh, domestic violence, uh, suicidal attempt. This kind of patients, they don't want to talk, and there could be many reasons, but we can't assume. <clears throat> everyone is different. So I think the best way is to approach the patients if they don't want to speak to you, like after you asking them what brought you here and they're not talking to you. So you can just acknowledge the feeling or the emotion you can see with your eyes. If you can see them anxious, distressed, sad, crying, whatever you can say straight away. Like for example, I can see that you are distressed out. May I know what bothering you? So start with direct question about the reason that not uh, making them not talking to you. Uh, <clears throat> so also you can say, you seem to be hesitant to speak to me. May I know what holding you back from talking to me? So direct questions. If he's still not talking, so start first by offering reassurance because psychiatry patients sometimes they could perceive you as an enemy to them or they may not trust you or whatever so you can tell them for example uh, your well-being is my priority so please let me know what's going on so I will be in a better place to help you uh, your well-being is my priority so please let me know what's bothering you uh, so I will be in a better place to assist you. So uh, also you can say uh, it is important to share your symptoms openly so we can accurately diagnose and treat your conditions. There are many ways to, to make the patient open up. I'm just giving you a few examples. Uh, but it never assumes. So sometimes they will be concerned about confidentiality. Also, you can say um, whatever you're saying is going to be confidential between me, between you and the medical team. So you need to say medical team instead of I because you need to involve the social service if needed. So uh, there are many examples so please feel free to ask me in the comments for more examples if you need thank you